Hello and welcome to another episode of RavisingBlog.in and today in this video tutorial I am going to talk about how to use the staging area of your WP engine. So as I described in my post also staging is a very good feature from WP engine which will allow you to create a replica of your live production WordPress blog to a test environment. So you will have uh, one production environment which is, which is your live WordPress blog and uh, there will be a test environment which will be a replica of your production or live environment. So in test environment you can play around the things like uh, you can make changes in themes or you can add a new plugin. It will not disturb your live WordPress blog which is open to the audience. So Sometime it happens like we try something new with our WordPress blog like uh, changing the source code like the theme editor or adding a new plugin and you know it blown away the WordPress blog. You will see like your blog looks ugly or there are plugins which are not working with the current WordPress version. So all these things can be avoided with this feature from WP Engine is called staging and it's very easy to use i'm going to show you how to use this feature in wp engine so once you log into your wp engine uh, admin dashboard uh, you need to go here which is on the top left uh, uh, menu which is wp engine once you click on that you will see an uh, option called staging once you click on the staging uh, you will see uh, two options here one is copy site from live to staging and the second option is copy site from staging to live so live is your uh, current WordPress blog which is you know open and it's, it's, it's production, it's live. The staging is a test environment in which you can make changes. It, it will be very much similar to the uh, live WordPress blog. The only difference is the staging is only visible to you. So you can see how the WordPress blog will look once you you know uh, make some changes or you know uh, add some plugin or something like that. So the first step to use this is to click on this link which is copy site from live to staging once you click on that it will create a, a copy of your live wordpress blog to the staging area so i clicked on that and this is the message you'll see here is staging ready so you have your test environment or your staging area ready for your wordpress blog here is the link which is you know my original uh, WordPress blog link is maxravi.wpengine.com. It will be like maxravi.staging. So this is staging set like it's a test area. So what we uh, you have to do to open the uh, it has a similar Word, WordPress uh, dashboard. So uh, if you see here, uh, this is my staging area, and uh, the way to open is. Uh, you need to use this URL and uh, then you need to add a slash slash WP dash admin. Once you click on that, it will open your staging area dashboard. This is a staging area dashboard and you can see that everything is very much similar from the production WordPress blog or live WordPress blog. Uh, you can make changes whatever you want to do. You can uh, go to your uh, theme editor, make some changes or you can add a new plugin. You can play around the things here. Once you are satisfied that whatever changes you made is fine, you can come back here on your original WordPress uh, live uh, dashboard. Uh, you can click on the second link which is copy site from staging to live. So what it will do? It will copy your test area which is staging area back to the production so your changes will start reflecting on the live wordpress block so uh, this is a very good feature from wp engine which will allow you to play around something new which you want to try with your wordpress block and uh, i have not seen this feature from any uh, other services i mean which provide me a live copy of the uh, my wordpress blog so I hope this video uh, helped you to understand how to use the staging area of WP Engine. We'll look forward to you uh, in my next video. Do not forget to subscribe, comment and share this video. Thank you.